What's up guys? Welcome back to the channel. Today we are going to talk about an issue in Assetokosa mods and how to solve it. Everyone who plays Assetokosa loves to have new cars, new tracks on the game. So there are two ways to do it. One is DLC packs, that's not free. But the best way is to enabling the Assetokosa mods. To add mods, all you need is a small application called Content Manager. I have added a link to download Content Manager. And if you don't know how to set it up, you can always google it there are plenty of tutorials that you can learn how to do it and also i have added the tutorial video on the description you can just follow it so back to the main issue once you install content manager custom shader pack and soul you might get a black sky and it won't go away even if you change the time or weather types in asarukosa in soul so I have searched for this and found an easy way to fix this. As you guys can see uh, in the video, I'm using the Shitoko Revival project because who doesn't love fast Japanese cars, right? So you won't see anything until you start the car from the pits. Soon after you are inside the car, the sky will be black as you can see in a minute. And it's a mess as you can see right now. So if you watch it carefully, you can see something like 68 needed on the right side of the sky wait a second you will see that right now so you can see it says 68 is needed on the sky so at first i didn't have any idea what this means but after some searching i found out that the issue happens because of some incompatibility in soul and the custom shader patch so let's see how to fix this issue first we will disable soul and see whether the problem goes away so there are two ways to do it if you are using the paid version of the content manager and if you are using the free version of content manager so this is for the paid version if you are using the paid version you can go to mods and just disable soul right away once you do that the soul will be gone and you can't use soul features in your game as you can see if you go to weather control script doesn't have soul and weather script doesn't have soul so it's just one option in the drop downs the soul is permanently gone at this moment if you are using the free version go to the installation folder of Asetokosa it's under steam apps and double click on Asetokosa then you have to find the application called soul uninstalled pet double click on that as well then you will see that soul is successfully removed and if you're not sure you can do it again and make sure that it's gone for good so now if you open the game you can see the black sky is gone but the colors are not that good so if you're concerned about the black sky now your problem is gone but the colors I won't recommend that this color scheme so back to the show so go back to content manager to fix this and you can go to settings and in custom shaders patch click on about and updates so you can see what is the current version that is installed on custom shader patch and you can see that's the recommended one but there are a lot of new available versions there and as you can see there is a 1.68 version that's what was on the black sky said 68 is needed so you can go ahead and install the latest version uh, it doesn't matter if it's untested just install it and now you can see the newest version is installed go to the game now by clicking on the drive menu and as you can see the issue is gone for good so the colors are back to normal again and the sky is clear so now your problem is gone no more black sky and you can just enjoy the game i have not selected the sky with clouds you can always change that in content manager app and i will be adding a video after this cloud so you can see that for sure so that's it that's how you fix the black sky and if you have any questions just uh, let me know in the comments i will help you fix this because you need this mod 
so that's it for today and thank you so much for watching and if you as i said earlier if you have any questions regarding this or installing mods or installing cars or installing tracks just let me know i will help you and if you want a tutorial video on how to fix or how to install content manager and all these mods just let me know i can make a video on that as well with all the basics so that's it for today and thank you so much for watching see you next time